We still got some camos to get, so today we're going to be getting the Battle Axe Dark Aether. So I just finished getting this thing leveled up in multiplayer, and let me tell you, this thing is not good in there, but we'll talk more about that when I do the Battle Axe Dark Matter video. But as you can see, I don't have a single kill with the Battle Axe and zombies yet, so we're going to have to get everything done today. And we're going to be going in with Aether Shroud. And since Forsaken just came out, there's no way we're playing any other maps. Let's go ahead and hop in and get this done. <laughs> we're walking in here holding a gun. We're not going to be using one. And if you haven't seen it yet, this is what the inspect looks like on the battle axe. Kind of nice. Way better than the baseball bat, in my opinion. But I'm a little nervous to do this because normally I like doing melee weapons, but the axe doesn't seem too great. Like it doesn't really have any lunge or like a whole lot of range. So it's like weird. And some of you guys have pointed this out that the first room does not go off of kills. It goes off of time, similar to the map moon. So I appreciate you guys pointing that out to me. Right now, it's not doing too bad. I always say that every time we're getting a weapon done in zombies within like the first few rounds, as if that means anything. But we got bonus points. We take those. If we can get some jackrabbits out of the way here, just real early, it's going to be nice. Actually, we can sit right up here. Easy. Oh, there's our first jackrabbit. Oh, wait. Can you kill more than one zombie at a time with this thing? Oh, there's a Cidic. I think you can. Look at this. Two zombies right here. Oh, wait. Three zombies right here. Just killed two. All right. So that's a lot better. I was thinking this thing's going to be super slow, super bad. But you can actually get more than one kill with this. It's got like sweeping edge. It's like Minecraft. Insta kill two. Let's go. I love this spot. I was hating on it that first video. Oh, stroke camo. Let's go. I was hating on it. Our first zombies video back on this map. I unlocked the cane. Let's go. Jeez. Stuff keeps popping up and interrupting me. But I was hating on this spot. Our first video on this map grinding camos. Because I didn't think it was going to be good for critical kills. But I, you know what? I take everything back. This spot's pretty fire. <laughs> Look at this. We're just racking up our jackrabbit camos. No! The invisible nuke got us. Man. I wonder how long I can just sit up here. I can tell what round, because we're already on round seven. I feel like I'm going to make everything just so much more difficult for myself the longer I sit here, but these jackrabbit kills are just coming too easy. I don't think I've been hit once this game. There's our gunrunner camo. Double points too. Okay, there's a lot of them now. We're still taking them out before they can climb up. This is busted. What the hell? No, the lunge actually happened. Oh, and we got hit. A lunge screwed us over there. It seems like it just lunges when it feels like it. And I'm down. But we're at our glacier camo. Zombies, go ahead and get away from me so I can do this. Now I'm going to go start up the portal because we already went down. We need to get to quick revive because I do not have enough scrap to buy a self revive. But I do have aether shrouds. So let's get those aether shroud camos out of the way. There we go. That's double camo right there. Go aether shroud again. This first area is so nice. There's our funkadelic camo. We already knocked out so many camos and haven't even gone through the portal yet. That was three camos right there as we're going through. This map's nice, dude. And we already have 20k. Oh, yeah. I definitely took my time getting here. A lot of zombies. Let's get the portal started. And then I want to do a few side Easter eggs that have been found since the last time I played on here. Forecast camo. We're still raking them in. Uh-oh. We're surrounded. Let's just jump down. All right. Let's go ahead and grab all these parts for the portal. Get the one in Burger Town first. Where is it? There we go. We got one. Holy shit. There's a lot of zombies chasing. In here. Where is it? Got it. There's another one. And last one, we need a flashlight. There we go. There's too many zombies for me to try to build this. I got to take them out. Come on. No. No hitting. It's not nice. Oh, I need to use stuns. Might as well just get all these zombies wound up here and get my stun kills in. There we go. One for you. One for you. You can have one as well. There you go. Oh, there's way too many. I don't know what I'm going to do past round 10. This is absurd. No. Move. Run. Oh, I almost backed myself into a corner. Get out of here. Go to bed. Good night. All right, let's go build it. We got to do it fast. Come on. All right, now let me in. Please. Let's go. Okay, these spawns here are really fast. So let's just run through. Open this up. The sickest room ever to be made. Uh-oh. How am I going to kill this abomination? This is going to be tough. Actually, I do have an Aether Shroud. All right, come on out, abomination. Oh! Literally 50 health. No. No. I have no self-revive. No, nothing. Where'd the abomination go? Oh, it's probably that big star on the map. There it is. Okay, I'm Aether Shrouding. Come on. Go down. I'm doing no damage to it. Okay, with this Aether Shroud, then I'm going over to the armor stand. I upgrade. Green. 
Okay, that might help out. Please exit the menu. Wait, I have an idea. Even though we don't have the portal open, I think this doorway over here should be. We need power for this door to be open? We do. No. That's so unfortunate. Oh, so is my health. But I wanted to go over to the Wonder Fizz and at least get like Elemental Pop or something to help out here. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have stayed in that first room for so long. It's just making this so much more difficult. Okay, let's stun these zombies and try to get them at least a little bit. This is like a boss fight. It's not supposed to be this hard this early on. That's what she said. Yeah, I got him one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, he almost just killed me in like one hit. Oh, 31 health. Go ahead, health. Regen. What is this? Max ammo? Perfect. We're safe. Get him. Sick him. What are you doing? He was just inking. Don't you charge at me, young man. No, no. We need to leave. I'm running until this health is regen. He's right behind me. All right. Full health now. What are you going to do about it? Idiot, I'm behind you. Oh, he can actually hit me with his tail. I didn't know that. Oh, no health. Gotta play Ring Around the Rosie with them. There we go. Don't hit me with your tail. Knock that off. Please die. Thank you. Oh, and the armor. Clutch. Jeez. That was tough. We really need this pack a punch. Like now. Let's do this. Grab this loose change. We're gonna need PhD slider. That's gonna help us get away. Also, got a pack a punch. Really quick. This is what the axe looks with pack a punch one here. This is pretty nice, actually. That camo goes on this well. I gotta get out of here before I die. All right, can I go back up now? Thank you. Now let's hit this button. It's gonna start the little cutscene. We don't really need to watch it. You know, already like top five or something in the world to get the Easter egg done first. No big deal. I'm gonna go ahead and skip it. All right, let me skip it, please. I'm holding skip. Is it this one? I'm holding both. I'm holding it. You can see me holding it. Oh, it skipped it. Let's go. I can hold him back for now, but please get to the town square. Yeah, it's probably not Maxis. Not today. We're going back up. I need to get to Wonder Fizz. I need to get a few perks. Oh, there's already a lot of zombies in here. Let me get a few kills here. I'm gonna get my Aether Shroud up. I'm gonna stun them. Get some camos in and grab some perks. We're gonna triple task. One more. Okay, I have my Aether Shroud. Let me get all these zombies together. Okay, stunning. Aether Shroud. Pop. Bang. And my game froze. Boom, pow. There's the rest of it. God damn it. It took this long. I had to fight the whole... What is it? The abomination on my own? Scan and repair. We'll be right back. Ugh. Pain. Pain and suffering. I'm just gonna try to rush to get to power again. Might as well get at least one more Jackrabbit medal in before we head in. All right, it's round five. Probably shouldn't wait any longer than that. Otherwise, we're gonna have the same trouble with the abomination that we did earlier. Unfortunate, but it has to be done. Oh, contamination camo. Let's go. Can I get into Burger Town yet? Nope, I'm broke. One more kill and I should be able to. There we go. Grab that. Okay, where's the next part? Right there. Oh, Wasteland camo. Let's go. Oh, we still need some more money. Oh, Grudge camo too. That's 250 kills. We're like a third of the way there. Good thing you don't need a crazy amount of kills with melee weapons. We gotta pick up the flashlight again. Where is it? Gross. Let's try to repair this before it gets too crazy over here. Please. There we go. Going in. Still need some money though. Come on, zombie. Max ammo, let's go. They're blessing us today. All right, let's try to take on this abomination as fast as possible. There we go. Got a little bit of damage on him. He might knock me here though. Another C4. Come on. One more. Let's go. We got the growl camo too. And a max ammo. Let us go. All right, through the portal. And power is on. Get this loose change. Let's turn on this button. Skipping the cutscene. You can see I'm holding it down. Holding it down. I'm skipping it. All right, but the main Easter egg I want to do here, the main side Easter egg, is the Ronald Ray gun one. So we just need an Aether shot through the door. What's up, man? Let's open it up. And we got to deliver some pizzas for him. It'll only give us like 45 seconds to deliver each pizza. So let's take one. And if we can do it fast enough and get him back in time, he'll pay us for each one. And at the end, we have a chance to get a ray gun. Revengeco, I really don't have time. I need to deliver this pizza. One goes here right in this box. There we go. One's delivered. Just a few more to go. Let's get stamina up. Oh, we're too broke. Okay, grab another pizza. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Stun. Okay, good thing they didn't kill Ronald Ray Gun. We need to leave. Let me out. Let me out, please. Please. Double points. We're still alive somehow. The entire round's after us. Get off me. All of you. How are we still alive? We're actually making it through. Ooh, okay. Give me my payment. Salvage stockpile. So this is our salvage before we pick it up. This is after. Not bad. Let's grab the next pizza and go. We're going to get stamina up just so we can do it a little faster. We have a box pizza right here we got to deliver. And just to make sure, I'm pretty sure the next one is here in Burger Town. 
Yep. And that one, the one after that is in here. Okay. So we know where everything goes. All right. Pay me. Oh, more salvage. Next pizza. Let's go. Zombies out of the way. I got to order. That nuke works. Back through the portal. Okay. Next one is going to be Burger Town. We got 28 seconds to bring it there. Plenty of time. All right. Here you go. One more. One last one. All right. What do I get for that one? More salvage. Sick. Last pizza. It's time to deliver a pizza ball. And there we go. That's all of them. Let's go see if he'll give me a ray gun for it. What do you got for me? Essence. Dick. 500 essence for all that. Get owned. At least that puts us over the amount that we need to get pack a punch. So let's go do that. And we can start knocking out our pack a punch camos. There we go. There's pack a punch one. And one more time. This is what the axe looks like with the forsaken pack a punch camo tier one. Not bad. But now I'm going to sit right back up on our truck. Actually, can we upgrade? We can. Get green. We can also get blue. That's about it. I love that animation. When you upgrade it, it it's like it's uh, it's pull-out animation. Like whenever you were to pull it out at the start of a multiplayer game or something, it'll spin like that. So I love that the armor stand does it. I wish there was a, a way to do that on your own without having to upgrade. Oh, and the Pack-A-Punch name for the axe is Axe Me Again. Come on, zombies. Bring it here. I need some money. We got perks to get. Jackrabbit metal. Let's go. We gotta be getting close on our Jackrabbit kills. One for you, one for you, another for you. Let's go. Our glitch camo, we're close. You gotta get the jackrabbits done early, otherwise it just gets harder and harder to do. And then once we start getting to later rounds, we have a lot more zombies. I can stun them, aether shroud, and then do what we did last time and hopefully just not crash. The biggest issue with this spot is that if I'm killing them before they can climb up, like as they're in their animation, they don't drop anything. No salvage, no nothing. So we're just gonna be stuck on blue for a bit. This is honestly really, really mindless. I just have to sit here and click. I'm not complaining though. I'll take easy camos wherever I can get them. Oh, we got some plague hounds coming in now. The degeneration camo, 125 while it's pack-a-punched. Let's get these guys looped up. I'm going to stun Aether Shroud. And let's try to get some kills here. Let's do one more stun. Make sure they stay stunned. One more. There's such a fat cooldown before you can swing again with this thing. It's kind of annoying. But we got our amphibian camo. As long as we're getting camos out of it, I'll be okay. What? That lunge almost just got me killed. This thing hardly ever lunges, but when it does, it's the most inconvenient time. Let me take out this disciple. Come here. No! Stun! Aether Shroud. Holy shit, I almost just died there. I got stuck. Okay, Mimic, you're done. Disciple, come here. Why can't I hit you? There we go. Jeez. See, the, the hit reg on this is so bad. Like, this battle axe could be, like, nice, but it... It feels like you really have to work your ass off just to hit anything. Like you can be right next to somebody and it'll still miss. Like that's a huge complaint I have with it in multiplayer. And it kind of carries over to zombies sometimes. Oh my, Lanta. No, I'm down. Everybody go away so I can self-revive. Nobody be here for this. Our stamina up's gone. You know what? I'm getting perks. First, let's get PhD. All right, through the portal we go. Okay, let's get quick revive. Jug, stamina up. Death perception, and I think that's good because we're, we're broke anyways. We're like really struggle busting over here. But now that we have PhD, we can do another side Easter egg. Okay, so there's these little like implosion marks on the ground and we just need to like jump off of something onto it. I think you just need maxed out PhD slider. Can we do one of these. Oh, let's go. We got the bunny first try. But basically now with the bunny, we can go up to the, what is it? Burger town and put the bunny in the statue. There's another one right here. So let's go up here, slide. Okay, that one's hard to get. I watched Lego's video where he jumped off of that roof, but I think it's going to take some practice for me to be able to do it. Let's try this. Nope. There's one more somewhere. Where is it? I guess it doesn't really matter. Let's grab Elemental. Oh, wait, we're broke. All right, let's decoy these zombies. Let's Aether Shroud. Try to get some hits in. Let's go. That's some camo progress, I'm pretty sure. Show me a camo, please. None that time. Jeez. All right, here's what we're going to do. Nuke. And let's load it into Bubby. Get that back open. Blow Bubby's back out. Now we're trapped in here. Throwing cheeseburgers out. What's up, Bubby? He's vaping. Bubby off that loud. Come on in, zombies. I dare you. We have to survive for two minutes. Let's go. Bloodshed camo. We're spawn camping the zombies. <laughs> Easy, dude. Where are the elites at? Oh, oh my God. There's the Panzer. Oh, there's another portal that opened up. Yeah, I'm throwing a molly at the Panzer. Oh, leave him alone. We have to defend him. Holy shit. They do so much damage. My God, leave him alone. No, I'm down. Okay, I have no self-revive anymore. 
Bobby's gonna die. Yeah, we just have to let Bobby die. I'm sorry, Bobby. Okay, well, since he's dead, we cannot redo the Easter egg, which is unfortunate. <laughs> it's a little it's a little difficult to do this thing with a uh, battle axe. We gotta go get some perks back. This has been a nightmare so far. And if we're fast, we can get to the Wonder Fizz before zombies start hoarding it. Nope, we're not fast. We can Aether Shroud to it, though. Let's do Quick Revive Stamina. That's probably good. I think I know the reason why we've been having such bad luck and why we crashed. We have to go back. We have unfinished business in this room. Oh, my God. Speaking of unfinished business, it's a fucking abomination. Hold on. One. Two. Don't knock me, please. Three. I need one more. There's one more. You can't go unkissed. Let me through. Let me through. Oh, got it. Let me out. Through the portal. Woo. That was way too close. All right. I'm going back to the truck. It's not safe out here. Oh my God. He's back. I got to take him head on. Yep. Shoot that laser. Can't corner myself. Got to get out of there. We'll try to stay up here for as long as we can. We might need to go get Shatter Blast on this. Oh, I need that insta kill. That's going to help so much doing damage to him. Okay, we got the insta kill. Come here. There we go. There's a two hit kill there. All right. All these zombies need to get the hell out of my way so I can get back on the truck. All right, we're safe. Can I hold them off though? There's way too many. 45 of them just climbed at the same time. Get off me. All of you. Back up. Let's go. We made it through. And we got a downfall camo. Can we upgrade anything? Do we have enough salvage? No, dude. We're so broke. Okay, I, I'm going to get Shatter Blast. I think I'm going to need it. All right, there's Shatter Blast. Let's head back. Oh, Mimic. Get owned. Give me that camo. Should I take these guys out? Now I'm going to throw a decoy close to the edge here and try to get these guys out while they're distracted by it. They took forever to get over to it and I can't reach them. Let's do one more. Shatter Blast, let's go. I got enough stuff to upgrade my armor to two and three. Let's go. That's going to help out a lot. And then next round, once we have the funds, we'll get PAP 2 on this. Oh my God. It's another abomination. They get here every round now. I'm Aether Shrouding. Did he just eat that zombie corpse? What the fuck was that? I'm doing no damage to it. Literally like none. Oh, this thing's pissed. I'm going to Aether Shroud. Hit him a few more times. I'm going to stick a nade to him. Two nades. He has way too much health. Why is he so loud? What are you doing? It's like he's constantly screaming. You need to die. Shut up. Why are you so loud? It's like my Aether Shroud bugged him out. There we go. It's still making the noise though. Even in death. Okay, now he's gone. Jeez, what the fuck was that? All right, time to get pack two. This is what the Pack-a-Punch 2 camo looks like on the battle axe. This is actually sick. I like this one a lot. It looks real nice on the axe. We're at 563 kills. Some of them are from nades, some from ammo mods. So we're a little further behind than we would like to be. Also, melee weapons don't take too long. So we're, we're pretty close to getting this thing Dark Aether, I think. And if not, after we get our like Bloodshed camo and all that, or what is it, Rotten camo? I'm just gonna start Aether Shrouding and Stunning and Decoying everywhere. So I'll just get as many kills as I can before I get overwhelmed. Let me throw the decoy. Bada bing, bada boom. We'll knock some camos. We still need like one more jackrabbit metal too, I think. Okay, I'm throwing it. Ooh, shatter blast. Love to see it. One more. Threshold camo. There we go. I think that's all of them. And our rotten camo. Okay, once they get up there, it's kind of hard to get back up. There we go. Actually, it wasn't that hard. And then we can aether shroud while they're all stuck there and they'll run right back into us. Nobody dropped decoys. That's a shame. I can't remember if it's 40 or 50 that I need to get. I think just to be safe, I'll buy a few more. Actually, I'm so low on salvage, I can't. Insta-kill, we'll take that. Especially if this disciple wants to come over here and fuck around and find out. Oh, no, I almost got the jumping kill on him. Gone. What'd you drop? A decoy? Thank you. There's blue tiger. Oh, I guess we haven't killed enough elites yet. That kind of sucks. Okay. All the zombies are piling up here. Throwing the decoy. Going in my aether shroud. Let's go. That was huge. We just almost took out the whole round with one Shatter Blast. And we got our Drenz camo. Imagine if that double point spawned before that. We'd be rolling in it. All right, I'm going to go get a few more perks. Because if we're going to need to keep stunning and stuff, I'm pretty sure we're done with it. Or, or just very close to it. But I think Meal Kick will help us out a lot just by saving us the decoys and the stuns. Even if we don't need to do that challenge, they'll, that'll help us stay alive up there. Let's grab it anyways. We need to work up an Aether Shroud first though. Actually, let's just do this. Want as much as we could. Now let's get the fuck out of here. I wish there was electric cherry on melee weapons. Like you could somehow trigger it. Everybody get out of the way. No. Oh, Shatter Blast comes to save the day. Same with this abomination and a stun. What is this luck? Let's just get out of here before we run out of it. All right. Back to the truck. No. That's like the 50th nuke. All right, abominations. Me and you then. 
gonna need you to stop doing that. Gonna Aether Shroud on you? Come here, bitch. Go ahead. Go down. Like, right now, please. 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 Come on. There we go. Back on the wagon. I'm throwing a nade at that disciple. Oh, shit. There's already zombies behind me. Oh, so low health. Disciple, you need to go. Like, now. Oh, let's go. Rising Tiger Camo. There's another disciple. You need to leave as well. Come on, Shatter Blast. Now's the time, Shatter Blast. Go for it, Shatter Blast, please. Oh. Okay, what is this, Disciple Day? Disciple, get over here to me. I dare you. Let's go, Shatter Blast. Jeez, that was huge. All right, Mimic, you first. Never mind. No! Let me up. Thank you. I'm going to throw a Molly right here. Ooh. The round just ended there with zombies still up? I thought that was only until, like, you open the portal that it does that. Stop hitting me! Come here. Die. Thank you. Mimic, go away, please. No! Aether Shroud. Almost died. I'm going through the portal. We need to get Quick Revive back, like, now. Because I... Oh, actually, I guess I do have enough to get a self-revive, but... That's all the salvage I have, basically. Oh, no. There's way too much going on over here. I don't think we can get it. No! Can we upgrade this really quick? Come on, purple. Exit the menu. Thank you. If I can hit one Shatter Blast... There we go. That helped out with the Aether Shroud a bit. Can we fill our ammo? Oh, we have Tomahawks. Bet. Nice. I just got a triple there with the Tomahawk, and I heard a power-up drop. What is it? Bonus points. I'll take it. There's more stuff on the ground there. If it's a decoy, we can grab that, run to Wonder Fizz, and then get our perks back. It is a decoy. Let's go. This one's been tough. It's a whole lot of just trying to get perks back. Actually, no zombies are even here, so I can just grab them. Okay, I grabbed what I needed. I kind of just, like, spam clicked, but I got quick revive. Let's slide out of here. All right, now we can go back home. All right, back to the truck. Jeez, that was a mission. Decoy going out. Shatter Blast, please. Please, if there's a time. Oh my god, Shatter Blast, let me down. Oh, Banish Camo. Okay, so we are done with our decoys now. It was 50. Oh, hey, got an Aether Shroud. I got cornered so bad there. Oh, now there's Shatter Blast on the smallest group. So what are we missing? Jackrabbits or Pack-A-Punch kills or what? I feel like all we have left is Pack-A-Punch. It's always with the melee weapons where I feel like I'm missing something. Shatter Blast, please go. Let's go. Look at that. Easy, Jackrabbit. Oh, it's Gold Viper. That's all we needed. It was one big hit. There's our chemical camo, too. It's all done. We've done it. That's two weapons Dark Aether so far this season. Now let's try to tough it out till our next X-Fill. All right, we have an X-Fill ready. I don't have very much money. I have no perks, no self-revive, no nothing. I can't buy a Gersh. I'm too broke. I bought a monkey bomb. We're going in with a monkey bomb and a self-revive. I was going to buy like a death machine or something, but I feel like that's cheap. If we're going to make it out of here, we're going to make it out through just pure toughness. Unfortunately, I won't be able to show you guys Pack-A-Punch 3 this time. Unless we miss our X-Fill window. But I'm going to grab as many perks on the way. I'm not stopping at the Wonder Fizz. If I see a perk, I'm grabbing it. Okay, Elemental and PHD. That's a solid combo. All right, let's start the X-Fill. I bought Mule Kick as well. Oh, we have to run all the way back to spawn. Oh, there's stamina up in here. Let me grab that. I'm coming, Raptor 1. Don't worry. 56. I have to kill this guy too. He already knocked me instantly. I don't have quick revive, so I just have to use my self revive. Okay, so let's do this. Before they all start getting attracted to me, monkey bomb. Enjoy that. Get a monkey bomb. Oh, that's huge. And I'm dead. Jeez, you really noticed the difference without Jug. I got down so quick there. But we made it out with Dark Aether. I guess that's all that matters. That th whole thing was a clusterfuck. The entire thing. We crashed first game and then we went down six total times. Ridiculous. But this is what the battle axe looks like with the zombies mastery camos. Here's gold viper. That's kind of nice. A lot of these DLC weapons, or at least the season six ones, have looked good with gold viper. Plague diamond, very clean. The whole top is all diamonds. The handle is that nice purple. Very cool looking camo. And dark aether. I'm kind of disappointed that it's only here on the actual like axe part, but I guess where else would it be? We can't have the entire thing be dark aether because it would just be too much. But let's go see what it looks like in game. All right, this is what the battle axe looks like with Dark Aether on it. Honestly, I do like how it looks in game better. Uh, and the gunsmith was a little underwhelming, but here, seeing it on there, it really makes the whole axe part of it shine. 
Now let's wait and see if we can get a little bit of that lighter dark aether camo. I think there it is over there on the right side. This camo is just so clean. Is it me or like right here on the right? It looks way brighter and then you bring it towards you and it's just dark. Like, I don't know why that happens. It must be the way this game like processes lighting or something. Give it one more second. All right, now it should look a lot brighter. That's pretty clean. But overall, I have to say this weapon was uh, mediocre. Uh, a lot of other melee weapons are a hundred times better than this. Uh, they swing faster and they have better hit reg. So you can actually swing at something and hit it if it's two feet in front of you. But it's a melee weapon. So I had fun, even though we did crash and go down a lot. We still came out of it with Dark Aether. With that being said, I'm going to have to end the video here. If you guys like this and you want to see more, go ahead and leave a like on it. If you didn't, you don't. Dislike if you're new here. Please consider subscribing. Put out all kinds of COD content throughout the week. But that's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.